Hey, how are you guys? My name is Jim Nolan. I'm one of the local specialists here at Momentum Digital, and I just want to take a few minutes to talk about local reviews and how you as a business owner can take advantage of them uh, for your company and in the long run for your uh, online presence. So local reviews are obviously a very huge part of you know, your online presence as a local business. Uh, we obviously talk to our friends and our family about recommendations for businesses to go to, restaurants to eat at, things like that. But the way the online community is today, we definitely turn toward the internet as a big resource to see how service has been, how people have interacted with owners and uh, employees of different companies, and just to get a real baseline observation of how businesses operate and whether or not we should take our own business there. So local reviews are a huge part of, of that. Uh, places like Yelp, uh, Google obviously has their own platform for it, City Voter, there are hundreds of review sites across you know, different industry specific areas or different niche groups of people where they interact and talk with each other about, you know, the best places to go and the best places to eat and things of that nature. So I just wanted to do a quick example with a re one of my favorite restaurants in the area, El Camino Real, right in Northern Liberties here. Um, as you can see, they have 273 Google reviews, which is great. Um, something that's huge is getting your customers or getting people to review your, review your business in general. Um, whether it's good, bad, uh, in the middle, anything like that, you want reviews on your site. One, to get a lot of good reviews, obviously, so people talk up your business. But if there are any people with bad experiences that you can work with them and work through them, uh, work through their issues and hopefully, you know, come out on top and come out with a, you know, hopefully a repeat customer, even if they had a bad experience the first time around. So as you can see, there are all sorts of levels of people um, that have just, you know, done a couple of reviews and then there are local guides as well. Uh, that are kind of more trusted people, kind of just uh, almost all-stars that review a lot of places and are big in the community discussion. Um, so another, another place is obviously Yelp, and you know things are broken down by the amount of stars, when they were there, and things like that. So a huge thing that you can do as a business owner and really take advantage of is responding to reviews. And that is like I said, is about you know working through the issues, uh, bad experiences with your company, uh, whether that be you know just a retail store or a restaurant or a service, uh, service industry company. Uh, working through those bad reviews is huge. One, you can a lot of times get uh, unhappy customers to take those reviews down, or other times you can get them as a repeat customer because you work through those issues. On top of that, places like Google, Yelp will start boosting your online presence because you're interacting. If you're a passive bystander, one, you're just giving the reins of your online presence just to the community and not doing anything for it. And so by participating and trying to interact with people, good, happy, and in the middle, um, you're going to be rewarded with your local presence being boosted for sure. Um, with reviews coming in, it can be a lot to manage. Uh, so luckily, there are a lot of tools that you can use uh, that are at your disposal that will better help you uh, manage those reviews and talk to people, but also tell you uh, when reviews are coming in, that way you can be on top of them right away. So the two places we recommend most are these two companies, Moz, as well as Yext. Uh, both of these companies work with a different variety of directories and review sites. Uh, that way they have a very broad sense of uh, where the information is coming from, and then you can attack it accordingly. So as you can see, there's tons of different review sites, tons of different listing websites. And as you can see up top, uh, for this company, you know, 31% of businesses in the areas have better reviews. So that's actually not such a bad score. Uh, that means they're probably about 70% better than almost everybody else, but it's definitely something that they can work on. Just getting more uh, reviews across more diverse websites will definitely help their local presence as well as hit those different industry places and as well as those niche groups of people. Um, if this seems too overwhelming for you, Momentum Digital uh, we man can manage these reviews and manage your listings for you, and we're always here as a resource to help you sort through them as well. So again, to end everything, uh, your local listings and your local reviews are a huge part of your online presence, especially as a local business. So getting on top of them and being proactive instead of reactive is the first thing you should do. Um, talk to your most trusted customers, your friends and family, your regulars um, of your business, and have them drop a review for you. If it helps out, give them a discount the next time they're at your store, their next visit, uh, to really prompt them to do that review for you right away. Uh, because the best way to get a lot of bad reviews down is have a lot of good reviews on top of it. 
And another thing was to, you know, work with your unhappy customers, contact them, try to work through the issue with them, you know, put their, put yourself in their shoes and see if you can work through the issues and have them either take down that review or have them leave a new review saying that you did work through those issues. Um, again, at the end of the day, it's all about being proactive and really being on top of all your reviews. Um, so I hope this was helpful and definitely read the blog that goes along with this. And again, my name is Jim Nolan. I work for Momentum Digital and definitely give us a call if you have any questions. Thank you.